Jack, you know, there are close to 1,400 homes lost now. Thousands of people have been evacuated. But this morning, KXAN is teaming up with Walmart and the Salvation Army to help fire victims. We were talking earlier about, I thought I had read that Walmart was going to kick off the donations with a $10,000 gift. Mm -hmm. And then they do 150000 to start this donation drive. So our Aaron Cargile is live at the Walmart in Bastrop with more on how you can help. Good morning, Aaron. Yeah, good morning, guys, and the donations aren't over. We are here at the Bastrop Walmart this morning, and just a few minutes ago, a semi-truck pulled up this trailer behind me. The goal is to fill this entire thing up. I think we can do it, and this Walmart is not the only place that we're taking supplies. Walmarts across Central Texas, Walmarts in Austin, Cedar Park, Pflugerville, Round Rock, and kicking off this two-day donation drive with me this morning. Morning. I've got the store manager here of the Bastrop Walmart, Keith Mitchell. Good morning, Keith. Good morning. How are you? Good. I need to make sure I thank KXAN as well as the Salvation Army for partnering with Walmart to start this drive for today and tomorrow. And in order to jump site start the drive, Walmart would like to make the first major contribution of $35,000 right now to the Salvation Army. So thank you very much for what y'all are doing. What? Walmart is just incredible. Thank you so much. And we do want to say thank you to KXAN, too, for their uh, help in promoting this. This has been just a great effort, and thanks so much to both of you folks for helping the Salvation Army. Hopefully, a lot of people will be served by this, and that's our goal. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. And this $35,000, that's not the first donation that Walmart has made. They have been helping firefighters and, and victims since this fire started. They've already, I think, chipped in $25,000 worth of, worth of donations. That includes tons of water, um, food that people need. And uh, we've been talking about supplies. There is a supply list on our website right now at kxan.com, a very detailed list of the supplies that are so desperately needed right now by these fire victims. So it makes it very simple. You come to a Walmart, to a donation drop-off site, you go in, get an item or two on that list or more if you'd like, and come and just drop it off. As I mentioned, we're going to be at Walmarts across Central Texas today and tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. And if you don't have time to come by, you can donate online. That's where the Salvation Army uh, also steps in. They're, we're doing that through their website, a very secure donation, and 100% of the proceeds go to help these fire victims. We want to thank you so much for all your help. We're looking forward to seeing you over the next couple of days. We are live in Bastrop this morning. Aaron Cargile, KXAN News.